Hello everyone, it's PC Helper here and in this video I'll be showing you how to fix freezing of the game Red Dead Redemption 2 on PC. So a lot of users have been reporting this problem, so I made a video on this topic yesterday and it's working for most of the users. But the problem that is appearing is that after performing all the workarounds that I have shown in last video, this problem gets fixed but the performance of the game is reduced so the users experience frame drops and lag in the game. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to fix freezing problem as well as frame drops problem. So you won't be experiencing any lag after performing this uh, after performing all these workarounds, and you will be able to play the game without any freeze, and also you will be able to play the game smoothly. So let's get started. So the first two step will remain same as the last video. So the first step will be clean booting your PC. So if you don't know how to clean boot your PC, it's really simple. I've made a separate guide of two minute forty five seconds. So you can just access that video by clicking a link in the description of this video. I will provide this link in the description of this video. Just click on that link, watch this video and clean boot your PC. Once you have clean booted your PC, proceed to the step number two. So step number two is just set your affinity and turn off two cores. As you can see, I went to this Reddit forum and here this user wrote, Hello everyone, I am having the same stutter issue like many other users. Fixed it with turning off two cores from task manager. It drops FPS but fix stutters at least. For me freezes and stutters completely gone now. Can play the game like until we got the patch. So what you have to do is just right click on your taskbar and go to your task manager. Open your task manager and here find rdr2.exe as you can see in this image. So right now I am not running rdr.2.exe in background because right now I am recording screen and many apps are running so my PC will be hanged if I do so. So I'll be showing it to you with the example of free download manager on how to perform this. So just go to details. You have to do the same with rdr2.exe and right click on it in details and set affinity. And here just select, deselect everything and only CPU 0 and CPU 1 should be selected. That is only two cores. Click on OK and that's it. As you can see here also this user just selected CPU 0 and CPU 1. So this is fixing problems for many users, but lag was appearing. So the same user edited his post and wrote, there's a better way to automate this process so you won't lose FPS with this way. So all you have to do is process lesser name software automates this process, download that program from its website, then do these steps. So you have to download process lesso. It's a software. I will provide you the link of its, its download link in the description of this video. Just click on that link. You will be redirected to this page here. Click on download. So once you have clicked on download, you will get this file to download. Click on download here and it's uh, just a 2.2 MB file. And once it's downloaded, its installation is also really simple. Just click on it and wait for it to load. Click on OK. Click on I agree. Click on next. Just deselect this. And click on next and click on install. I've already installed it, so I won't be installing it again. So once you've installed it, you just have to open it and you have to select rdr2.exe, right click on it, click on CPU limiter and here enter these things. You have to enter when CPU uses 98%, reduce the many CPU, this many CPU cores, select one and for a period of one seconds. So you have to do the same. So I'll show you what to do. Open it and once you have run rdr2.exe, minimize your game. Right now I'm not running that game. So I will show you what you have to do with the example of chrome.exe. You have to do the same with rdr2.exe. Right click on it, click on CPU limiter, 98%, 1, 1, add a rule and click on OK. So once you have done it, your problem will be surely fixed and without any lag. So thank you for watching this video. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button below. Also don't forget to subscribe for more content. Thank you and have a nice day.